leading a class of George Street normal school pupils with one of her self-penned songs. Natalie Yeoman started off teaching general classes, but for many years has specialised in teaching te reo Māori, plus a huge range of other activities. Um, I do the school choir, the senior choir, which is about 50 children, and I, do, I lead the kapahaka group, which is about 80 children, and I've done that now for about um, 12, 12 years. Um, and I do music projects, write shows for the school, music assemblies and things like, like that. Yeoman estimates she's composed more than 100 songs as teaching tools, of which 17 have recently been published in a music book and recorded onto compact disc. Some of them I've written especially for the teaching of te reo Māori around the school, um, so that's why some of them are very child-like songs for, for junior children. Um, some of them are more complex and more elaborate, so teaching of language, Māori proverbs, whakatauki, um, and local legends. So different songs for different levels, but having said that, a lot of them have become popular right through the school. She says the songs are effective for teaching, with the lessons within the songs staying with the pupils for life. It provides a really fun way of learning, so that children come to te reo lessons and have fun, and that's really important because you want everyone to have a positive attitude towards it and become more um, more inquisitive um, and more interested in what they're doing and so music's a great way of doing that. Having had some health issues over the past few years, Yeoman says she'll retire at the end of this year, spending more time with her grandchildren and some more musical projects. In Dunedin, The South Today.